Hi, this is Ming Seng again. Um, question, would you personally buy property with problems such as a haunted house, a murder cases inside the house, someone passed away inside the house, or bankruptcy cases? Well, it actually depends on whether you're buying for investment or own stay. If you're buying for investment, actually, I don't think it matters so much. In fact, uh, it's all these problematic house that sometimes you can find some un good undervalued gem. But if let's say for your own stay, it also depends on whether you're a superstitious type of uh, person. If let's say you were to ask me personally, I will, if I were to own stay, I probably would avoid those uh, haunted houses or those with murder cases inside. But I'm less concerned if let's say it's just a bankruptcy cases or or someone passed away inside the house because those are quite common nowadays. Uh, yeah, I, I guess it really depends on personal preference. Uh, but importantly, I always tell my client, it has to be something that you feel right about the house. If you feel right about the house, then actually all this doesn't really matter. So I, I hope you really get into a house that uh, you're you're very comfortable with lah. and if let's say you're, uh, you want to know how, how to go about getting these houses well come and look for me